I don't know if I'm really I like reading these in real time or not, but you know, I think there's a little bit of a delay. I think you're not from this planet. Yeah, no, I'm not from this planet. I'm fucking nuts. Is actually what's going on. How many pairs of boots do I own? Man, it is getting out of hand. Out of foot. That also is out of hand. I think I need a manicure. It's getting a little rough. Um, too many shoes. Shoes are the easiest thing to buy online because like, you don't even have to try them on. You just like know your size. Although, sometimes these boots are a little narrow, so you got to go size up or two, you know. His from Mars. His is... He's he's from Mars. Busted, like so busted these nails, you're right. I think as I like 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 when they don't dry all the way, it's like you can kinda like pick it off. I get I like like that. It keeps me busy. What are my thoughts on Sweden? I love Sweden. Thank you for liking the attitude shoot. I really like it too. I think it turned out great. Austin is an amazing photographer. We had a lot of fun that day. And my good friend Abria, who I've known for years, who's done my hair for years, um, so you have her to thank for a lot of these looks. She uh, was on set that day helping, helping style my hair and check things out. I think more and more, like the longer that I've been doing this stuff now, it's like I really like working with people that I'm already friends with and I've stayed friends with or made friends a long time ago, and that's nice, you know. It's nice to like. Have like a trust, a creative trust with people. I, i.e., you know, Brian and Roger, like I trust those guys. Like we've been working together now for over five years. It just, it's nice. It's good. Oh, you guys are cute. Yay. Yay. Oh my God. We. <laughs> this is not a strip tease, Lulu. Calm down. When's the new album? Yeah, I still haven't figured it out yet, guys. I've told you this. Okay, I shouldn't be waiting for a question, but I think I am. Yeah, if you guys didn't know, um, I, I'm actually leaving on Monday, leaving LA on Monday, and I'm heading to London. And I'm gonna do some press interviews and such out back on stage and, uh, you know, put my new outfits on. <laughs> and uh, yeah, it's gonna be really fun. And then back to London after Europe for some shows there. And you know, I love London. I love it, love it, love it. Um, did I go to university? No, I did not. Um, I don't know. I don't think that I, I don't think that I'm a school person. I don't know. I think by the time I graduated high school, um, I was just really wanting to get into the world of performing like on a professional level. And I do think that there's a lot of stuff I could have learned in school. I probably would have gotten something out of it, I'm sure. But I also got a lot out of like the experience of working, uh, of, 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 performing um sort of learning on the job um i guess there's different ways of looking at it but i i found that was just better for me and a lot more fun top or bottom Ooh, someone's getting sassy on this <laughs> top or bottom <laughs> To be totally honest, most of the time I'm more of a top, but you never know. Um, why am I awake? It's only like 10 here. Why are you awake? Oh. What are you oh, my, OMGing and girl knowing about? I love RuPaul's Drag Race, and actually, I need to watch it. Uh the episode that came on tonight because I love that show. 
Pharaoh is still chilling, chilling, minding my business. Yep, he's out. Yeah, my pup is right here. Everyone's asking about the dog. He's like in between my legs. When I sit on this couch down here and I I like uh, recline it, Pharaoh likes to like curl up at my feet and use my two legs as sort of an inner tube. Ooh, Selena Gomez or Demi Lovato. That's like a deep, deep question. I feel like I don't even know if I can answer it. But I've never met Selena. I like some of her songs a lot. But I've never met her. I have met and worked with Demi. So I think I would have to pick Demi because, you know, like, we have, like, we've, like, had a conversation. And many conversations. And, by the way, did everybody catch the Demi-Christina Aguilera duet, the new song, and the performance at the Billboard Awards, and the music video, directed by Luke Guilford, who also directed Another Lonely Night? Have you guys seen that? Did you know that it was the same director? How about that? I really liked it. I thought that was an awesome video. I thought... I think the song is fantastic, and I really liked that Billboard performance. I thought it was really cool. And also, a little known fact, Nina McNeely uh, helped do the... She staged it and did the creative design for that that um, performance on the Billboards, and I've known Nina for years. I love Nina. Nina's Nina was... In a couple in a music video of mine at some point, and we did a lot. We did the AMAs together. I mean, it goes in. It's so exciting, and this uh, this sounds like corny bullshit, but it's so exciting to see people that I've known for a long time along the way here in LA, like m- moving forward and like being the creators that we always should have been, and 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 turning into the people that are directing the coolest music videos and creative directing and styling. And I'm just so proud of my friends. A lot of people, a lot of people that I'm seeing like really like moving forward and doing really good work. It's cool. Peaches like the fruit or the artist. (laughs) Is this a call me by your name reference? Am I in love right now? Not with any person. No. (laughs) <laughs> wait what was that last question that person asked mixed voice advice or notice me at least mixed voice what do you mean Will you shave? Probably not anytime soon. (laughs) Solo projects, talk about it. I've been talking about it, Natalie. You tuned in late. Okay? What do you want to know? What are you so curious about? Yes, Reeve Carney. I saw Reeve and his brother Zane and their sister Paris on stage the other night at the Troubadour, and I was blown away. They're like I was joking on my my caption that I posted that picture on. It said that they should call themselves Music School because literally it's like watching them. I feel like it was like music theory. It was like they were so good that I felt like I was like at a, like. A lesson, like I was like learning. I was meant to like understand. You're at school right now. Send help. What could I do from here? Did I ever see Bowie in concert? No, I didn't. I would have loved that. You're so blurry. That's because it's dark in here. Get into it. I'm like an impressionist painting. Okay. Uh-huh. 
What's your key for the life? My key for the life? Um, I don't know. Try to stay present. I was talking. I was writing a song the other day, and one of the things we were talking about was. What did, what did she say? It was with Sarah Hudson, my good friend. And we were talking about how if you obsess too much and you're too focused on the past, you get depressed. If you are too focused on the future, you get too anxious. But if you are present, that's when like the really good stuff happens. And it was interesting because it's a simple concept, but it makes so much sense to me. I think it's really true. makeup artist or do I do my own? Uh, I usually do my own. I'm a theater kid. I know how to beat this mug. When did I first put a band together? I was in a band, um, I think I was like 26, 25, 26. We didn't really do any that many gigs though. We had like three, <laughs> four. You know, it was. Like, I think it was like we were more in a band for the fantasy of saying to ourselves and to our friends, oh yeah, I'm in a band, but we didn't really like really do it. The live is blurry. I'm sorry, guys. It's it's probably my Wi-Fi. It's probably not great. And it's the lighting. Oh, thank you. What is that person's name? Benter? High key, girl. High key. New hairstyle? Uh... I mean, is that like a backhanded compliment? <laughs> you're like looking at someone, you're like, you can have a new one soon? New hairstyle? Like, fuck you? <laughs> I don't know. What do you think I should do? I mean, I'm open to suggestions, but like, it, you know, uh, what are you looking for? Should, you know what? It might be time for me to just break down and just get into some lace front wigs. <laughs> can you imagine? If I was like, on the carpet with like, you know, Nazarene, biblical. I mean, I secretly kind of wish I could pull off everything that Jared Leto does because he always looks great. But um, I, yeah, I would need a lace front wig and that might be a little bit much. Oh, she says no new hair. No. Are we really talking about my hair? All right, well, I might have to wrap this up in a minute. Platinum Blonde, didn't I do that? I've done that, though. And, like, let's be honest, the platinum hair thing is getting a little... Is there any other color that we can do? Like, I just feel like I see it everywhere. Although it always does look kind of fierce, so... Fair. You know, I haven't figured out if I want to do any new tattoos. Like, I do want to do more tattoos, but I don't know what. So, no need to force it. Like, I need to, like, wait until I'm actually inspired by something. I kind of want to get one on my thigh. I think that's a cool spot. I've been with a couple boys. And they have them on their thighs, and I think it's sexy. <laughs> oh, Pharaoh. Say hi to everybody. Chillin'. I think I'm gonna wrap it up, guys. I wanna go, I wanna watch um, Drag Race. I think it's time. And I just realized that earlier I think I thought that it was like nine o'clock and it's actually like 11 something, which is hilarious, but time warp. Couch lock, time warp. What's the, what, what a man, what's a man of your dream? I don't know. Mm. 
Benji. <laughs> I see that. Benji. Benji. Don't go. Bye. What are you going to ask me, Solomon? I'll ask you once more. Are you going to be bossy? What are you asking me? Do I have a boyfriend now? Nope. Single. Ready to mingle. Hey, 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 hey. Give me a tingle. Can you imagine my face was just like this all the time? Did you call me a cracker? Wow. <clears throat> oh, Drag Race. Right. Got it. Got it. 